Now let's go to Job chapter 8. What they said again about Job. I'm just taking you somewhere. You will learn very soon. Job chapter 8 verse 4. I'm taking you somewhere. Look at some of the things that they were saying about the life of Job. He says, when your children sin against him. But let me tell you, Job's children, do you know what Job used to do for them? When they are having a party, Job will go and look for sacrifices and make it ready at the gate. The moment the children finish their party, Job will sacrifice for them. And he says that maybe when they were having the party, they might have sinned against God. So let the sacrifice, so the children were blameless, but still something happened. There's somebody here, you've not done anything, but some Christ are coming around you. Jesus. And some people are asking you, you still pray, but why are you still going to what you are going to? I came to let you, sometimes God wants to use you to show up to the devil. God, Jesus. Because sometimes, listen, some of you, your life has to be an example unto people. God has to use you to brag. Yes, Lord. Now look at this one. With all the challenges she went through, she didn't leave the church. She didn't leave God. Jesus. But God Himself has done something. Yes, and I came to give you good news. I know somebody's here. Somebody's here. Somebody's here. I hear somebody speaking to me and say, Prophet Daniel, I like what you are saying, but right now, what you are saying, what if my own has been there for a long time? And God, so if you are using me to show up, uh, God is too much for me. Can I give you good news? The Lord told me to tell you today there's going to be an expiry date of that issue. Amen. The one who shot the loudest statement. Amen. Said the expiry date is coming right now. Jesus. So the expiry date. Expiry date. Let's go to verse 5. And it will shock you. Now they are telling you, if you look to God and plead with the Almighty. Now you you do pray more than Job. Now they, they are telling him, if you are pure and upright, God Himself will restore you. But the verse one says Job is an upright man. So now there's a dichotomy in the test. There's a tension over there. Look at it now. They are saying that Job, if you are holy, so let's say he's Job. Now the friends are saying Job, if you are holy, God will deliver you. But the verse one says Job is a holy man. What will you do? Jesus. His friends, listen, people are talking because they don't know you. Thank God. They are, they, they don't, they are saying, if you are holy, God will help you. But the Bible says, he's a holy man. So what will you do? When you know who you are, but conditions have caused something to happen in your life. Yes, now Job is asking some questions. The friend will insult Job. And Job look at them and tell the friends, you my friends, I thought you came here to comfort me, but you are miserable comforters. 16 verse 2, look at it. He says, I've heard many things like this. Miserable comforters are you all. You came to tell me you want to be with me, but now you are insulting me. Which is, and it's not everybody who tells you they are your friends who are actually your friends. Yes, sir. They are just waiting for something to happen for their two colors to show. So sometimes, might it be sometimes the pain I go through is God making sure wrong people are leaving me. Yes, sir. Because because where God is about to take you, if the wrong people are still around you, they will put you down. So God will put you into a challenge and see who can be with you. In your valley. Because hear me, if you, uh, this one you can choose this one. If you can't be with me in my valley, you can't be with me on my mountain top. Jesus. Ah, that's why some people left you. I said, if you can't be with me in my valley, yes, don't come around me in my mountain top. Because in my valley is the place of loneliness. <laughs> Nobody is there. But after I go to my valley, yes, God takes me out of the valley yes, Lord. and places me on top of the mountain. Jesus. There is somebody here, your story is about to change. Son, I receive it. I receive it. <laughs>